Hey, Tony here. Today I'm going to do a Blu-ray steelbook unwrapping of Batman Begins, so stick around. So today I wanted to take time to do an unwrapping of the Batman Begins Blu-ray steelbook. Here's the front, and here's the back. If you'd like to check out all of these special features, you can go ahead and pause and do so. I'm going to go ahead and remove this from the wrapper and we can take a close look at this still book. Okay, I've got the wrapper off and the J card removed. Here's the front of the still book. Really nice looking artwork there. It is a matte finish, so it does show a little bit of scratching. Here is the back. There is no embossing or debossing. We open it up. We have our front and back together. Really nice looking image. On the inside, we do have our one Blu ray disc with some disc art. And we do have some inside artwork. So overall, I think it's a really nice looking still book. So overall, I think this looks pretty nice. I do like the artwork on this. It is kind of blurry looking, uh, but not too bad. Um, as far as Batman Begins, I was very excited when this movie came out just to see Batman on the big screen again. Um, I think Christian Bell did a pretty good job playing Bruce Wayne and Batman, um, but I wasn't a real big fan of this particular film. It seemed like it was a little bit overdrawn um, with the origin story and everything, but overall I think it's a really nice um, looking still book. Please leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think about this particular still book unwrapping. And also let me know your thoughts on Batman Begins because I really do enjoy reading your comments. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I really appreciate it if you would subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Instagram, TikTok, and on Twitter. And if you'd like to find out what I've been watching, you can find me over on Letterboxd. I do have links below. But thanks again for watching and we will see you next time.